The son of the president of the United States, Hunter Biden, has been indicted on federal gun charge. Now, that indictment comes after a plea agreement on tax and gun charges fell apart in July and amid a probe of his finances by House Republicans. Today, the son of the president of the United States indicted on three federal gun-related charges. Hunter Biden is accused of lying on a form while buying a revolver back in 2018 by falsely claiming he was not using illegal drugs, also facing charges of possessing a firearm while using a narcotic. The indictment comes after a plea deal fell apart that would have had the president's son plead guilty to the gun charges, along with separate misdemeanor counts of failing to pay his taxes in 2017 and 18. This is what happens when plea deals blow up. The prosecutor says, OK, you want your plea back? You don't want to you want to go to trial? Then we're going to indict you. The deal collapsed when, under a judge's questioning, prosecutors said it would not protect Hunter Biden from any further charges potentially related to foreign business dealings. That's an area House Republicans have been investigating for months, now launching an impeachment inquiry seeking bank records and other documents from Hunter and Joe Biden as they try to tie the president to his son's business affairs. So far, they've not produced evidence making that connection. Yeah, any comment on the Hunter Biden investigation, sir? The case is being overseen by special counsel David Weiss, a Trump appointee who the Biden administration kept in place to continue leading the investigation into the president's son. The indictment comes as President Biden is fighting for a second term, allies working to insulate him from the younger Biden's legal battles as the president stands by his son, who he says is working to rebuild his life. And right now, Democrats on Capitol Hill are coming to President Biden's defense, while Republican lawmakers say these gun charges are unsatisfactory, arguing that among the charges Hunter Biden could face, these are the only ones that clearly cannot be tied to the president.